course between now and June. And then, by the way, even after Kyrie went down, if Kate did not say that, I did not say that. What I said, because I was there when I said it to both of my brothers. <laughs> bro, if you don't know, I'm going to ask you something. What month is it? This is, this is, this is January. Oh. Yes, I have. I don't trust the Brooklyn Nets. Are they, are they for real? Of course they are. Are they a great basketball team capable of playing great basketball, beating anybody in any month? Of course they are. But what's their history? How many times do we have to see them implode? They don't even, the, the, other, the opponent is not the problem for the Brooklyn Nets. The Brooklyn Nets are the problem for the Brooklyn Nets. We don't know if Kyrie is going to decide to stop playing basketball, go to somebody's birthday party for four games. There's something every year of their own doing, Stephen A. You can trust them if you want. The media hates the Brooklyn Nets. I won't even say hates. The media is such full of shit. Michael Wilbon is such full of shit. Jayla Rose is such full of shit. The, they bring up every excuse for every other team. The Boston Celtics just got blew out by 40. They talking about it's, it's, it's January. It's January. You know what I'm saying? I don't you know. Something's going to happen. The media is waiting for something to happen with the Brooklyn Nets. This is the most disrespected team in the NBA right now, bro. 12-game winning streak. A different coach. They're not mentioning that. It's a different coach. Coaching matters. They're not, you see that you see they are not, they're not mentioning that at all. And the Boston Celtics do not have Joe Missoula, and their defense is worse than last year. I'm not giving out that extra credit. I, I mean, I'm, I'm gonna do what they call splitting the baby. Yeah. The NBA media, not Stephen A. Stephen A is, is rocking with him. Stephen A is rocking with him. He picked the Brooklyn Nets from the beginning. But a lot of the media has has not been talking about Brooklyn because they have been playing so good. But when the Kyrie situation was happening or KD uh, asked for a trade, they was everywhere. They loved talking about them. The NBA media wants the Brooklyn Nets to fail. They waiting for the Brooklyn Nets to fail. And that's sad, bro. The Brooklyn Nets are finally playing good basketball, and you got NBA media hating on them. If you look at their history, bro. I mean, if you look at their history, well, who knows if Kyrie going to take a day off? Who knows is this? Has he took one off yet? Do y'all not realize that the problem was Steve Nash and not the Nets? Not KD, not Kyrie. It was Steve Nash. They have a whole nother coach who they believe in and who they respect and who was their leader. They did not have identity, a leader. But you know, the NBA media, the NBA media, they want to say what they want to say. Milwaukee is not better than Brooklyn right now. They're not. Boston is not better than Brooklyn right now. Boston is losing the OKC by 30. Miss me with that, bro. The media is full of shit, bro. I'm out.